I'm joined now with Paula Smith from Catholic Charities of Chemung County, or no, Steuben County, I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you. So now we have a stocking stuffer suggestion. That's right. Um, tell us about, there's a wine event coming up in February, so tell mm -hmm. us about this wine event and why people should get tickets now. Okay, great. So uh, Paula Smith with Catholic Charities of Steuben, and good morning to you and good morning to everyone at home. I'm just so excited to be here to tell you about this opportunity yeah. in the season of giving. This is an opportunity for you to give a gift not only to a friend, family member, or loved one, but also to give a gift back to our community. There are more than 15,000 people living in Steuben County right now that are living at or below the poverty line. And the largest segment of that and the most vulnerable are our children. And so the reason why we're talking to you about this today, even though the event is in February, is because all the proceeds raised from this event go to benefit Catholic Charities and the work that we do in the community to help alleviate the effects of poverty on our children. Nice. So that is through basic needs services, that's your food pantries, that's um, uh, emergency utility assistance, uh, emergency prescription assistance. We have programs that uh, work to, for healthy fam family functioning, um, healthy child development, and healthy uh, habits for children and families. Nice. So it's really the gift of giving, which That's is right. awesome for yes. this time of the year. Yes. So um, tell us about the event itself. It's okay. February 5th. Uh, yes. What can people find there? Okay, so the event is organized in cooperation with Bottles and Corks, okay. and that is on Market Street in Corning. And they bring together about 10 different wine distributors so that attendees can sample more than 50 wines from around the globe. Wow. So it's not just local wines. Um, we are being hosted this year by the Rossetti and Rossetti families. Those are two families in Corning oh, that okay. are, have very deep roots in the community. They are very well known. They are very well respected and we are just so happy to have their support for this event. Nice. Um, it's a lot of fun. So in addition to sampling wines, there is also live music by Bruce Holler. Okay. Uh, there is a silent auction where you can bid on all kinds of exciting items. Uh, and experiences, so anything from golf outings to skiing trips, there's Steuben Glass, um, art from local artists. It's different every year, but these are some of the things that we already know we're having. We're raffling off things like uh, cool. a Nexus 9 tablet, um, $100 gift certificates to some really nice restaurants around the lakes and in the area. Uh, okay, awesome. There's, yep. Yeah. Oh, Connor's Mercantile, I don't want to forget to tell you, is, nice. is going to be there featuring their sweet chopped chocolates. Oh, yeah. So, what's better than wine and chocolate, oh, right? Oh, no, I know. So, a lot that people can enjoy now. The most important part how can people get tickets? Oh, right, exactly. So, tickets are for sale online on our website at Catholic Charities Duban. Dot org. Okay. You can also buy them at Brown Cigar Store, which I believe is at 6 West Market Street, okay. or Bottles and Corks, of course, at 130 West Market Street. Okay. And you'll have them at the door, I saw, too. Yes, yeah, so they're available at the door. They're $25 in advance, so that's the advantage to buying them in advance. For the holidays now. For the holidays now, and, and as, like I said, all the proceeds go to benefit Catholic Charities, so they'll benefit the children now. Wonderful. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Paula, for coming in, telling us about the wine tasting event coming up. Thank Get your you. your tickets, the gift of giving for the holiday season. Thank you so much. We have to take a quick break, but stay with us here on WENY News.